Hi everyone, it's Miss Carrie from Bridgeville in South Fayette Township Libraries. And what we're doing today is basic stitches. So I'm a beginning sewer and I found this amazing tutorial or um, 30 day stitches off of Jennifer Jangles at, on Etsy. And we're going to try it out together step by step. Let's see what you'll need. For this craft, what you'll need is an embroidery hoop, some fabric, needles, embroidery thread, and scissors. We'll be learning the Lazy Daisy Stitch. And as you can tell, it's really cool because it makes like a flower shape. And the other thing that's really cool is that it's very similar to kind of the chain stitch. You're going to do a similar action to that. How you're going to start is just like always, you wanna pull your needle all the way through the back of your fabric like that. And what you're going to do, just like the chain stitch, is you're going to put your needle back through the stitch hole that you just made, and you're going to create a loop like this. Then you want to bring your needle where you want your petal to be, pull, and then you're going to let it catch. And then underneath where you just made that stitch, you're going to put your needle there underneath that petal and then that's how it'll catch. And I did mess up a little bit right here. I think I put it a little too far away and um, from the rest of the petal so it looks a little wonky but that is the gist of how you do a lazy daisy. 